I thought I'm gonna show you guys something cool that every Dodge vehicle has. <laughs> Nothing. Okay. All right, that did not work. So basically, they're saying that when you press a combination of uh, buttons. Like it should be two unlock, one lock, and then one unlock. It starts some kind of a, like a light, you know, show. Well, I'm all ready. This is the next day. Get my sneakers, get my pants, get my long uh, sleeve t-shirt because it's slightly drizzling outside let's go so step, stage one is a warm-up right they recommend walking for five minutes and it helps that my new stopwatch is actually a clock so i'm gonna start running at 8 20 and there's a there's a path uh, there's like a biking pedestrian path just further down there. That's why I'm walking here So now I was just measuring 60 seconds Very windy today But I'm feeling good very inspired by this couch to 5k plan That's 60 seconds and now we're just measuring 90 seconds of uh, fast walking lots of properties for sale here in my area call me call me for sale <laughs> and that's the path over there that's where I'm going uh, away from cars because of course that's not good running next to the traffic with all the gases and uh, pollution and one of the reasons of course I started running is I've been trying to lose some weight and so I think the worst I've been in the past couple of months was uh, 198 198 pounds that's totally unacceptable then I managed to get to 195 and then at one point I was 189 but then I had some wine I ate some bread so this morning I'm uh, 190.2 190.2 so another 60 seconds of running and then we'll keep doing this for 20 minutes now I'm lucky to live very close to these two schools there's one school here and there's another school over there and they have like two huge football fields between them and so this bike path you know goes along side of these double football field and that's what i used in in winter for uh, nordic walking you know like walking in snow it was pretty good pretty good training you know so we start from there and like one big circle is about takes about 10 minutes to walk so it's over over a kilometer 
All right, that's another one. Minute 30 seconds. Stop, reset, start. Run. I decided to go on the field because the ground is dry. It's way easier to run here than on the pavement. And this is and since this is pretty much my first running experience in 40 years, maybe slightly less. You know the thing I'm still struggling with is finding the rhythm. When I was jogging for two hours and one hour, you know, back when I was 25, 26 years old, you know, your body had a rhythm, right? You, like your hands, your arms, you know, your feet all worked in a unison. It was like a machine. But now I'm still looking for my speed. Slower, faster, jump a bit higher. So still working on it. So hopefully the feeling of the rhythm will come back one of these days. Okay, where are we? Love this stopwatch. Very easy, two buttons. Stop, reset, mode. Mode switches back to, to, uh, to the clock. I think I cheated a little because I started at 20. I was supposed to stop at 8.40. But I decided to do one extra 60 second jog. Basically moving ahead of the plan. And the election signs are still here. That's the guy I voted for, and he actually he won. He uh, he won in my district. So now he's going to be member of the parliament or MLA in Alberta. I feel good. You know that runners experience what they call a runner's high. Because if you, when during this, I think it's physical activity, your body releases endorphins. And that what puts you in a good mood. So very good, uh, you know, if you feel melancholy, stuff like that, running. Are you guys still here? Can somebody pass me the soap, please? <laughs> <laughs>